What is up, YouTube? This is Josh right here, back at it again. And today, I'd figure we would talk about um, this one kid on the Chicago Bears, the quarterback, Mitch Trubisky. And what a season the Chicago Bears are having this year. Um, so far, I think right now, they're in third place right now, three and five. And everyone was saying, oh, that um, last year, oh, Trubisky is definitely going to be changing this team around. Oh, we are so going to win the Super Bowl this year. I, or we're so going to meet Patrick Mahomes in the Super Bowl. First Super Bowl ring since 85. Well... Shut up, birds. I'm doing a video. Thank you. Anyway. Oh, uh, yeah? Oh, well. It, it's probably the Ravens. Thank you. As I was saying, <laughs> Mitch Trubisky is a huge bust. Wait. Last season, he had a really good year. Not too bad. Got the Bears to the playoffs. They lose to the Eagles. And the Eagles get, get demolished by the Saints. and Who then get demolished by the Rams. Um... And then, so, everyone was saying, oh, Trubisky is the best thing ever. Our best quarterback in a long time. The Bears this year have not had a very good offense. And part of the reason is that the Bears are so focused on Trubisky. Like, when they drafted him, like, I mean, they passed up on great quarterbacks such as Mahomes and... That, um, the one kid, what's his name? Deshaun Watson, I think is his name. The one quarterback on the Texans. And what's one thing both those quarterbacks have in common? I know this doesn't really make, make sense. Or this doesn't have to do with anything. But both those quarterbacks have to face Tom Brady this year. And that's always a challenge. If you're in the AFC, you're facing Tom Brady. Because... Yeah, that, that's always a challenge. And I'm not saying that as a, as a Patriots fan, but to be mean, but it, it seems like that's always a challenge in the AFC facing the Patriots because whether you, you beat them like Lamar Jackson did or you, or you automatically lose to them. But back to Trubisky. So Trubisky this year has just... This has not had a really good year. The offense this year for the Bears have been completely terrible. They've had so many turnovers. Um, there are a few flags. Um, I watched them a couple uh, weeks ago when they played the Eagles. Um, there were more turnovers. I mean, there probably wasn't a lot of turnovers. I, I, I could be wrong. But Trubisky just could not get the job done in that game. He just couldn't get the job done. And Bears fans at my school are telling me, Josh, I, this Trubisky guy is so overrated. The dude is terrible this year. And the Bears just will not move on from this guy. I'm trying to think of 
a good example of this. Kind of like when... Hmm, I forgot who, but I uh, can't really make a good... Um, similarity, make up a good similarity to this, but the Bears will not move on from Trubisky. I mean, he's hasn't been great this year for the Bears. The Bears' offense is again hasn't been great. Their defense, though, is their defense is all right. I will give them that. The Bears have a solid, solid defense. Um, but yeah, that just, um, so it comes down to this. Do you think Trubisky is overrated? I think he's kind of overrated. I mean, I've seen the guy play a few times. Everyone was saying the, this guy's going to be great. I mean, he had a he had a really good year last year, and then this year, it, I don't know. Um, he could be like, like uh, what's his name? See, look, I can't make that joke anymore. See, look, now I don't, now I don't know who, what I was gonna say. But yeah, um, hopefully the Bears can turn it around in the later half. Now that we're in the, we're towards the end of the season. I think we've got like. Let's see, what week are we in now? Week 11? No, no, the Bears are not making the playoffs. Far from it. Maybe they might do it next year, but... that one, Also, that one... The other QB that the Bears have, I don't know his name, but... He's pretty good. That, that um... I, I think he's like a second-string quarterback, but... Um, I, I, don't, I don't know his name, but he, he's really good. Definitely better than Trubisky, in my opinion, anyway. But, Bears fans, let me know in the comments below what your thoughts are on Mitch Trubisky. Do you think he's overrated? Do you like the guy? Do you hate him? Love to know your thoughts and opinions in the comments below. Leave a like, subscribe. We are 30 subscribers away from 100 and also make sure to subscribe to my boy prince stupidity's channel if the giants lose again uh today probably he'll probably make another rant about that so keep an eye out for that i called it last last week when they lost to the jets that he'd make a rant about it what happened he made the rant and it was pretty funny as well. So go subscribe to him. Um, um, yeah, thank you all for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next one.